Oh, hello, fellow Vehicle Sim fans. Welcome back to Korovac Vehicle Sims. I'm Marcus Korovac. Today, we're continuing on with part three of Off Road October. All right. So, we're out of this valley over here that we got thoroughly stuck in last time. We've got plenty of fuel, truck's in good shape. We're gonna go on a little bit of an adventure. So plan is we're gonna come down the road and cross at this same spot here that we got the UAZ through, if we're able to. And then come down over here. This section in here is going to be very wet. You can see by how dark it is, but I figure if we skirt around the edge of it, bring us back over here towards where the garage is. Alright. And that's going to be our route. And we'll see how it goes. So a total of 800 meters Let's do it. So far, so good. Looks like I spoke too soon. Let's... Let's try this.
And as long as we stick to this slightly higher ground, it shouldn't be too boggy. Actually, a bit of a road down there. So this is the fun thing, is that some of the roads show up on the map quite clearly. And as you can see in this case, some of them don't. So your map is not perfect. It's, it's a good guideline of what's going to be out there, but it does not show you absolutely everything. So there is still a certain amount of exploration to do. Oh god, this is boggy. Let's gear down to a crawling gear. Try to get through the worst of this. One of the fun little details is that the maps are actually pretty, pretty accurate to how things actually would be. So up here where there's better drainage, it's not too bad. And then right down there, where there would be sort of natural stream, gets really boggy. And then as we get back up here again, we sort of rise up and out of the mud, and it's not nearly as wet. All right, so we're gonna go a little bit over here. Notice how there's another wet section right here that we have to uh, get around. So we'll just go a little bit further over this way, give it a wide berth. Try not to get right into the middle of the worst of it. this nice and slow. There we go. No problem at all. Alright, so we're going to go a little bit further and there should be a path off to the side coming up. Could sneak through there. There's also clearly tire tracks up ahead here as well. So again, as you see, there's a road clearly marked here, and we are on a road, but it's not on the map. So this is one of those little secret paths. right up there where those power lines are. That's our main road.
Perfect. So we fixed our three damage, filled up our fuel. The garage will fill up to 200 liters of fuel in a truck. This truck maxes out at 160, so it can easily fill itself up, no problem. And then we also refueled our spare tire in here, which you can actually see. That actually disappears when you use it, reappears when you get back to the garage and replace it. And then also the garage trailer itself is now full up as well. So we've got all of our repair points back. So now we've got a lovely little support truck. Pretty nimble, can get pretty much anywhere. It's got plenty of repair points and lots of fuel. So we can nicely fill ourselves up. All right, we also have one garage point in the um, back of the truck. We can also put on a garage cart, which is another one garage point. That gets us a total of two garage points. It takes four garage points. Let me see over here to unlock this garage up in the top corner. So this truck with the garage uh, tent and garage tra uh, cart on the back would be able to do half of that. So two trips of that. Or alternatively, you can get a larger truck, carry a larger um, um, trailer with more garage points on it, and unlock it in one go. Honestly, either way um, works. Um, figure we'll fig bring the rest of our trucks over and use one of the 4320s. And just do it in one go instead. But in the meantime, we've got this wonderful support truck all ready to go. Just gonna back it up off to the side here. Park it up, and then it's ready to go. Muscle that log out of the way. Perfect. And stop engine. Perfect. We set out to do a goal, and that goal worked. Didn't roll, didn't get stuck. That was almost too easy. Alright. It's nighttime now. Figure end the episode right here just a short little episode then we'll bring some more trucks over to the garage outfit one of them for um, unlocking that garage up in the top corner and that can be a project for another day we also have to still get our k700 the the big tractor over here get that repaired um, and uh, refueled uh, two 4320s and we've got a jeep that's sort of um, parked up at the at the fuel station that can stay there for the time being. Oh, and we also dropped off our medium log cart. So this guy here, this 4320, can grab that on the way through. And then we've got some watch points to unlock over here. We've got another fuel station up here and a garage up here. So this can be our new base of operations. And then our log kiosk is over here so logs come from there and they go over here to the lumber mill so basically we have to carry them the length of the map from this corner over here all the way down to this corner over here so we need to scout out a route and uh, plan out what that's going to look like and have some support along the way so that we can refuel our logging trucks uh, repair any damage have recovery in case anything uh, tips over or crashes so there's, there's some stuff left to do. We're just getting started. All right, so that should do it for now. Just let the night pass. Have a nice rest after you know our misadventures so far and, and our minor success.